boy DJ Wolf here. Um, got a couple things on my mind. I went to go see the Wizards play last night. Again. Probably the third time during the season. Once during exhibition. Once during the regular season. Which is just about a month ago. And then last night during the third round of the playoffs. Of the third round of the first round. Well, like this, the third game of the third of the first round of the playoffs. And uh, they played the Toronto Raptors. They lost the first two in Toronto, and they came back last night and spanked that ass. I'm telling you, uh, John Wall, Bradley Bill, and Otto Porter were on fire last night, man. Along with Gortat, who was really, uh, he really came in when he needed to be in there. I was like, wow. And, oh, don't forget, uh, oh, I think his name, Kelly O'Dell. Yeah, Kelly O'Dell or the Odell. Well, I, forgive me if I pronounce the name wrong. I'm telling you, he's a sleeper. Don't sleep on that young boy. I'm telling you, he, he may be, he's very well the future of uh, the franchise. You know. But, man, they um, their game was awesome last night. I'm really rooting for him, man. Cavaliers, you know, I'm from Cleveland too. You know, I, I live in Cleveland. I'm originally from Cleveland. And I've been living down here, uh, wow, going on 30 years this year. So, you know, I got to root for the Wizards. You know, and they're killing the boards this year, man. I'm, I'm, well, they're finally doing something anyway. Hopefully, they can keep, like my son said last night at the game. If they can keep that momentum and play those games like they do aggressively, man, they can take them on. But you got to watch uh, Toronto's firepower because they they got guys who actually can, can uh, lay jumpers on you in a heartbeat, you know. But you got to actually stop stop that uh, that shooting from the perimeter. If you don't slow down that perimeter shooting, scoring from Toronto's offense, you're in trouble. I'm going to tell you right now. Especially when you got guys who don't step up to the plate. But last night, they, they stepped up. The squad stepped up. And that's what you need. You need the, you need the four to five to, to get it in. And losing up on those mistakes. Stop making those, you know, easy mistakes and keep on, keep on, and keep it on. You know. Because I think they can beat, they can beat, they can beat Toronto. You know. You just got, you just got to Guys, stop that three dumb three point uh, uh, perimeter shoot, man, from uh, Toronto's offense, man, and they're pretty good. Um, if you can, they're, they're not they're, as far as being in the paint. Sometimes they struggle, but the Wizards going to have to be more consistent in, the, in the, on their offense, especially getting in the paint. So, and I think they got a good chance, man. If they, if they can hold up and do what they did last night. They can do the same thing tomorrow and keep it going. So, Wizards, go Wizards. I'm rooting for you. I know you do well. You know, on a side note, my, my son said he met, uh, he ran to uh, John uh, Ward at uh, a club uh, by, I think, last year or something like that. He said, good people, man. So, all right, guys, y'all keep doing what y'all doing, man. Uh, we'll be rooting for you, and I'm definitely going to be watching tomorrow night. It's DJ Wolf.